So, who is the villain? Well, that would be none other than a man named Patrick Clausen, a lobbyist for the Washington Institute for Near East Studies. Now, according to their website, their hope is to see the emergence of a more peaceful, secure, and prosperous Middle East. Well, that sounds so innocent, right? Who wouldn't want a peaceful and prosperous Middle East? Well, check out what he had to say recently. It's very hard for me to see how the United States uh, president can get us to war with Iran. Um, which leads me to conclude that if, in fact, compromise is not coming, that the traditional way of Amer America gets to war is what would be best for U.S. interests. If, in fact, the Iranians aren't going to compromise, it would be best if somebody else started the war. What? If the Iranians aren't going to compromise, it would be best if someone else started the war? Is anyone listening to this? Warmongering hawks like Clausen are openly calling for the U.S. to strike Iran first in order to jumpstart World War III. Oh, but it gets better. I mean, look, people, Iranian submarines periodically go down. Someday one of them might not come up. Who would know why? <laughs> We can do a variety of things if we wish to increase the pressure. I'm not advocating that, but I'm just suggesting that uh, it, it, it's, this, this is not a, a either-or proposition. Of, you know, it's just sanctions has to has to succeed or other things. We are in the game of using covert means against the Iranians. Yeah, man, let's just sink a submarine and blame it on Iran. Great idea, you sociopath. And Clausen. You know as well as I do that the U.S. is doing far more than just sanctions. With the Stuxnet cyber warfare along with the military buildup on the Strait of Hormuz, seems like the cage has been rattling for quite some time, just hoping Aquadenejad will bite. But these aggressive tactics still aren't good enough for war hawks like Clausen, who are just salivating to jumpstart the next war. So he's actually advocating a false flag type event in order to justify an attack against a sovereign nation. Can't say that surprises me, but what does surprise me is that these people are shamelessly advocating it in open forums. People like Patrick Clausen, who openly lobby for death, destruction, and want to drag the world powers into a military standoff, make me sick. And that's why he is our villain of the day.